Hello, and welcome to ClearLine's Introduction to Fiber Optics. This lesson provides a basic understanding of fiber optic technology and introduces the ClearLine NSF advantage. We'll start with a look at the digital dilemma facing both consumers and integrators. Then, we'll define fiber optics, explore how the technology works, weigh its advantages and considerations, and finish up with a summary. Let's get started. Consumers and integrators are currently facing a digital dilemma that has been building for years. Let's take a look. In the past, our entertainment and communication was analog. We got letters, read newspapers, watched VHS recordings, and made mixtapes. That's all changed. Email, websites, and audio and video streaming have replaced their analog counterparts. Digital technology is now the preferred standard. The Internet is ingrained into our lifestyles. With 68.2% of American households having access to broadband Internet, data is now a utility, just like water or electricity, and the demand for ultra-fast data transfer is growing. For years, copper UTP, or unshielded twisted pair, has been the standard for network cabling, carrying the ones and zeros of digital data as switching electrical pulses. One is on, and zero is off. Continuous redesign has helped it keep up with the speed and bandwidth demands of new technology. The pace of technology has increased the need for speed. Today, nearly every new product is network capable, driving the demand for more bandwidth. According to Cisco, global IP traffic increased eightfold from 2005 to 2010 and will quadruple by 2015, hitting 966 exabytes for the full year. That will be the equivalent of all the movies ever made crossing IP networks every four minutes. Copper UTP is struggling to keep up with this astonishing pace. Fiber Optics is a rival network cabling solution that is challenging copper to become the standard. Fiber easily meets the speed and bandwidth demands of today and the foreseeable future. We are at a crossroads. Copper is struggling to meet the demands of today and will need upgrades for tomorrow. At the rate technology is advancing, copper UTP will quickly become obsolete. Fiber optics is the clear choice for today and tomorrow for both the consumer and the integrator. With the transition to fiber all but inevitable, let's explore this technology further to stay ahead of the curve. Optical fibers are long strands of glass approximately the diameter of human hair. When arranged in bundles called optical cables, they can transmit light signals over long distances. Although small, the anatomy of a fiber optic cable is fairly complex. Let's take a look at the three main components. The core is the glass center that carries the light pulses from the transmitter to the receiver. The material surrounding the core is called cladding. It reflects light back into the core. And finally, the buffer coating is the outer coating that is removed using a stripping tool. This protects the fibers from damage and moisture. Fiber optics is a tremendously powerful yet simple technology. Let's take a look at how it works. Instead of electricity, fiber uses pulses of light to transfer data. The digital signal is encoded into light pulses and sent into the fiber. A phenomenon called total internal reflection keeps the light trapped inside of the core as it travels through the cable. A fiber optic relay system is made up of three major parts. An optical transmitter encodes and produces the light signals. The optical fiber conducts the light signal over a distance, and an optical receiver accepts and decodes the signals. It's a little like kids playing spy. If one had a laser pointer, he could flash a message off a mirror in the hall, around the corner, and onto a door for his friend to see. Let's review the advantages of using fiber optics for both the consumer and the integrator. First and foremost, fiber doesn't lose the signal strength at higher frequencies like copper does. This is important for two reasons. Speed and distance. Its higher frequency capability allows fiber to transfer more data in less time over longer distances than copper. 
This is fiber's greatest advantage. The increased bandwidth fiber provides is essential as home technology advances. Along with computers, digital tablets, and smartphones, other devices including webcams, home automation products, and smart TVs require a network connection to operate at full potential. Fiber can easily deliver the necessary bandwidth for the ever-expanding home network. Fiber optics also delivers a cleaner signal. Electrical signals over copper are susceptible to electromagnetic and radio frequency interference which negatively affects performance and reliability. Because fiber uses light and not electricity, the signal is not affected by interference of any kind. Fiber optics also removes a potential fire hazard, as lightning strikes and electrical power surges can't travel over fiber. And fiber is easier to pull because of its smaller size and lighter weight, saving time and energy when wiring an entire home or building. As you can see, fiber optics is a powerful and convenient technology. But even the greatest technology comes with some considerations. Let's take a closer look. Fiber optic cable has a strict bend radius tolerance. If the cable is bent too far, the cable's performance will suffer. This can be an issue for integrators when pulling fiber throughout a home. But the biggest challenge when using fiber is the termination process. The integrator needs specialized training and tools that can be costly. In addition, the integrator needs an extremely controlled environment to terminate fiber. Dirt on an exposed fiber will hinder the cable's performance. Fiber shards that can embed in the skin or eye are very dangerous and must be collected and discarded safely. And the process sometimes involves dangerous chemicals that may be flammable. Quarantining space in someone's home to terminate fiber is inconvenient and sometimes impossible. And even the best integrators must take their time to get the termination done properly. Terminating one side of one cable takes between three to five minutes. A modest home with structured wiring will have around 15 drops. The 30 terminations will require about two and a half hours of work from an experienced technician. Terminating fiber can be a costly and time-consuming process. Let's stop here and review what we've covered so far. The demand for bandwidth is growing rapidly. And it's clear that fiber optics is better equipped than copper to deliver the necessary speeds for the technologies of today and tomorrow. But fiber has its challenges, most notably its complex and time-consuming termination process. What if there was a fiber optic cable solution that made termination easier, safer, and faster? Something revolutionary. Clearline non-strip fiber is that solution. Clearline NSF is easier. It requires fewer tools and has a much more forgiving bend radius. Clearline NSF is safer. It eliminates dangerous shards of fiber and the need for alcohol solvents. Clearline NSF is faster. It can be terminated in about 60 seconds. In short, Clearline NSF delivers all of the advantages of fiber optics without the costly and time-consuming termination process of typical fiber. Be sure to look for the next lesson in this series, the Clearline NSF difference, to learn more about this amazing new fiber optic cable solution. That wraps up our introduction to fiber optics. Thanks for tuning in.